The following is a demonstration of Dynamics 365 field service integrated with IoT and Remote Assist. On the screen, you're looking at Azure IoT Central, which is getting the real-time reading from a device connected in the field to the internet. We see a decrease of pressure that has just been detected and an alert is automatically created in Dynamics 365 field service. This alert automatically generates a Dynamics 365 work order, which allows for us to schedule and dispatch this workout to a technician to be completed. If we move over to the schedule board, we can see a map of all of our current technicians, trucks that indicate their current location coming from the mobile device installed on their phone, as well as all these different resources are color coded for their routes, and we can even see the different progress of their work orders, green being in progress, red being traveling, and blue being scheduled. On the bottom, we have all of our unscheduled work. Here we have one urgent IoT alert work order that's been created. We can click on this and visually see where it is on the map. We can leverage the scheduling assistant embedded within Dynamics 365 field service that automatically recommends the closest and appropriate resource that has the characteristics and certifications. So here we can see the travel times estimated from their current location or previous work order. I'll go ahead and book Chad for noon. This is going to automatically create that booking record where we'll then see a couple of things happen. As we look at the phone on the right for the mobile technician, they'll get a push notification that they've been assigned to a work order as well as if we flip over to the customer, the customer gets an automated phone or text message based upon their preferences. So here we can see a text message to the customer, Benjamin Dalman, letting him know that his work order has been assigned to Chad for today. If we click on that push notification from the resource, it takes us right into the Dynamics 365 field service mobile application where I have full access to the work order and all of its data, such as the service account and who the work is to be done. I have any instructions while I'm on site to complete, as well as I can see the IoT alert that generated this work order. I can see the customer address and get turn-by-turn -turn directions using my phone uh, to route me around traffic, as well as the system can automatically associate tasks for me to complete products for me to consume out of inventory and labor that can be tracked. We can also attach notes such as pictures if the device was installed or completed, as well as we can capture customer signature, which may kick off invoicing in our back ERP office. Now, if I'm the technician and I'm on site and I need assistance from an expert who is not with me on site, who's remote in a different state, in a different country, we can leverage Dynamics 365 remote assist to get this done. To set up the scenario a little bit further, the technician travels to the location and is then standing in front of the machine, in this case a water heater, and the technician is gonna use Dynamics 365 remote assist to call Antoine, who's back in the office, who's an expert, and all of this is done leveraging Microsoft Teams. So this demo is done on a, a phone, although the same demo could be done leveraging a HoloLens, which is the device worn on the user's head for complete hands-free interaction. Here you'll see the call from Antoine's perspective. Let's take a look. Hey Antoine. How are you doing, Chad? Good, good. So I'm on site. I'm in front of the water heater and I'm having some issues getting it to turn on. I went ahead and I replaced that pipe back there and I was wondering if there's anything else you notice that I should take a look at as I'm having trouble getting this thing to turn on. What I would do is take a look at the hose you have here and then take a look at your outlet. It looks a little loose there. And then you probably sh that that should get it started for you. Oh, oh yeah. You know what? <laughs> that wasn't even plugged in. Let me go ahead and replace that hose with the tape. Uh, I'll rerun the diagnostics, and if I have any questions, I'll reach back out. 
All right, thank you very much. Let me know if you Awesome, appreciate the quick comment. After the remote assist call is complete, the technician has the ability to post the video call to the booking in the work order by selecting the work order. That then places a activity record that says a remote assist call was placed between the users and optionally the, the call can be stored on Azure for compliance, security, and training purposes.